I'm Susan, and today I will be reading a book called The Witch's Ball by Lori Reese. It's about a witch named Millie who's getting ready to go to a witch's ball. I chose this book because witches are very popular, and I thought that listeners might like to hear about witchy things like broomsticks and bats and hats and spiders. I hope you enjoy The Witch's Ball. One bat landed on Millie's head. Come to the witch's ball, he said. Doors close at 12, be sure you're there. Oh, cried Millie, what will I wear? Two mice scurried across the room as Millie grabbed her trusty broom. Then off she flew to gowns for ghouls to find the perfect dress and jewels. Three giggling ghosts who ran the store said, here's a gown that you'll adore. The dress was pale and ghastly white. This gown won't do, not for tonight. Four dangling spiders called from above. We'll make a gown we know you'll love. They slowly spun and wove a dress. The long wait caused poor Millie stress. Five hooting owls awake at night watched Millie as she made her flight back home to comb her stringy locks and slip into her snakeskin socks. Six ancient rings adorned her hands with creepy bugs placed on the bands. Millie tied, when Millie tied her violet shoes, the lace tore loose and Millie stewed. Seven pointy hats piled up high made Millie stand below and sigh. The broomstick swished this way and that till Millie found her favorite hat. Eight old bottles sat on a shelf with perfume Millie made herself. She chose the one that reeked and glowed, but it was out a breath of toad. Nine creaky bells began to chime and Millie cried, it's almost time. But much to her surprise, her broom would not fly up and leave the room. Ten helpful cats began to claw at Scarecrow, who was made of straw. The broom repaired once and for all, rose up and flew straight to the ball. Eleven wolves howled at the moon. I won't be late. I'll be there soon. Beyond the clouds, the castle loomed, and from inside, the music boomed. Then at the door, she gave a knock, and suddenly she heard the clock. Yippee, she said, am I in luck? For at that time, the great clock struck 12. The end. I hope you enjoyed the witch's ball.